Well, great to see you. A man in form on top of your game. I imagine you're, you're a happy camper at the moment. Yeah, I'm enjoying my, enjoying my time, enjoying my uh, football. Um, obviously, spring the pommy a little bit, coming back from, a, from an injury and obviously a bit of a frustrating time out of the team. But um, yeah, really enjoying myself. Does it sort of sum up a football as a lot? The managers say you've got to be ready, and you obviously were ready. Nobody would have foreseen the, the illness to Rico and, and an injury to Geth, but uh, as you say, you obviously were ready because you've not put a foot wrong since you got in the side. Yeah, it's obviously the old saying, you know, things change very quickly in football. Um, firstly, it's obviously good to see Rico back um, fit and healthy and, you know, back involved. And obviously with Geth picking up a nil, it's great to have them back. And, you know, it's just more competition, um, uh, obviously strength in the squad. So. And I think it shows, yeah, it's good. Yeah, testament to yourself, but also the fact that it's been a brand new look, brand new looking back three, really. George has played a lot of the season, but he's stayed in the side, and Owen Toll's coming alongside you, a rookie, really, at this level, but the three of you have gelled very well. Yeah, yeah, we've done, I felt, you know, I think it's shown the results that we've, we have done really well. Um, obviously, two, totally a bit younger, but yeah, the two young lads either side of me, and <clears throat> I think, you know, they've, totally has been brilliant ever since he's come in, and Jono has been, you know, consistent this season, so, I had a conversation with the gaffer when obviously I was going to come into the team because of the injuries and the illnesses, um, where to kind of put me. But I feel like going in the middle, it's you know I can be a bit of a leader and kind of direct a little bit and push and pull people about. And you know, but you know you don't have to be like I said earlier. You, you don't have to be a, a captain to be a leader. If you can have five or six of them on the, on the pitch, you know it really helps. So I feel like we've got that kind of team spirit and energy at the moment where we're, we're grinding out, we're hard to beat and enjoying it. Yeah, you are hard to beat. A good unbeaten run at the moment, considered one in the last four games mm -hmm. and then uh, importantly got a really big and impressive win at Barnsley on Monday. Yeah, definitely. You know, as, as defenders we pride ourselves on keeping the ball out of the net, you know, and hopefully the boys at the other end can uh, can do their stuff, which, which they have been. So, um, you know, look at the couple of games we drew, you know, personally I feel like they could have been wins as well. So. Um, yeah, it's Saturday Saturday will be a very tough game. You know, they're a team obviously in form and top of the league, so it's one we look forward to. Yeah, you go into it in great shape because it was a really positive performance at Barnsley on, on Monday, wasn't it? That kind of done the confidence any harm at all. Yeah, it's a tough place to go, Barnsley. Um, so you know, picking up a win there is huge for momentum and belief for, for everybody. So there's no reason why we can't do it again on on Saturday at home, but with a uh, with our crowd behind us. Yeah, it's fully focused and a professional job for, for you guys, but for a big occasion on Saturday, the league leaders in town will be a, a big crowd. It's one to look forward to, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. You know, as players, these are the games you want to be playing in. Um, games at the top of the table between two teams, it's going to be a, a good occasion. But, um, you know, I believe that we've got enough to go in and go and take the points. Your former club, of course, I know you were down there just a couple of years. Enjoyed your time down there, I believe? Yeah, it's a great club. It's a... Uh, very well run club you know it's got a great fan base you know I obviously still know the staff and a few other players and you know Shuey's, Shuey's a great coach and obviously it's just a manager and he's doing really well so you know, it's great to see them flying and um, obviously that all goes out the window when when we play against them at the weekend but um, no one, one definitely I'm looking forward to. Yeah they've not dropped many points they're in good form of course that, that can turn quickly and I'm sure you're going to give a real test on Saturday, but the side's above you. You've just got to keep looking up and just keep chipping away and, and see how you go. You're nicely back in the top six. You're only out for a day, of course, but it's done a good, yeah. good shape. Yeah, exactly. We knew, we knew these six, seven games, there's a lot, we're playing a lot of teams in and around us, and it's easy to start looking ahead. If we beat these, if we do this, if we do that, you know, that's not the way to look at it. You, obviously, we're, we're one game at a time at the moment, but obviously you, we have one game and you haven't really got much time to think because it's quick, quick turnovers um, after every game. So. Um, yeah, we're, we're one game at a time and we, we look at Saturday now. And just lastly, as you said, it is a game to look forward to. I know the supporters will and it's a big month and it just feels the other clubs are starting to bubble up again nicely, isn't it? There was a record crowd against Derby, got a big pop at John's game on Tuesday and you're in the thick of the action. Definitely, yeah. You know, we've we've got a great opportunity to get to Wembley. Um, you know, we're right right in the mix at the moment for, uh, you know, in the playoffs and we're, we're looking up the table and trying to chase them down.